Many patients are not aware of the maximum allowed acetaminophen dose, and I, I think many times they're not aware of how much acetaminophen they're taking. They only think they're taking acetaminophen when they're taking Tylenol, for example, yet they're not aware of the acetaminophen that is combined in a, in a whole range of other uh, over-the-counter uh, medications. So it doesn't take much to get up to 4,000 milligrams, for example, per day uh, without realizing it, um, where, for example, they may maximize the acetaminophen um, taken as Tylenol, let's say, up to 4,000 milligrams, but they don't count the acetaminophen that is in their cold remedy, for example. So, um, so therefore, I think um, it's, a, it's a step in the right direction to decrease the daily allowed dose to 3,000 milligrams, and also, just like with the anti-inflammatories, make them aware of the, of the end organ effects and the hepatotoxicity with acetaminophen. Um, and also, we need to keep in mind that the, the, the toxic effects of acetaminophen are pretty much time-driven as well as, um, as, well as dose-driven as well. So if somebody is on it for a very long time, you don't have to give them an over-the-counter acetaminophen. You can just convert them to something and just take them off of it completely.